everyone, welcome back to All Time Medieval Simulation, it's me again, and I'm doing the historical battles right here, so, I'm gonna first do the Battle of Agincourt, so, let's start this, and then here, it looks like it's my army right here, and then, I, there's also Fran French, two French armies, well this one only contains like some cav, this one, yeah, a lot more troops, so let's start this. Okay, I'll start soon. The Battle of Agincourt. Yep, it's going to start soon. All right. Fourteen fifteen, Northern France. So this happened in France. The Hundred Years' War continues. There's King. After There's spending King the Henry. autumn months campaigning right in northern France, Henry V, King of England, is making his way home. Okay. But first he must contend with a large army awaiting him near the town of Agincourt. Mostly containing of chivalric knights. The French army, dismounted. led by Jean Le Mangre and Charles d'Albert, is more a collection of arrogant nobles than an army distracted by their own bitter rivalries. Okay. While the English army is a disciplined force, led by King Henry, a shrewd commander and an inspiring presence. All right. As the sun rises on the 25th of October, Henry moves his weary and hungry men into position, oh, so knowing hungry. they are largely outnumbered. They are outnumbered. Heavy rainfall overnight has left the newly plowed field separating oh, the two forces. Oh, they're going to use that terrain as their advantage? Alright. The French forces awake and take a leisurely breakfast, happy to wait and let disease and hunger grind down Henry's army. There's Henry's army. Knowing this only too well, Henry moves his army forward, hoping to provoke the French into rash action. Henry's gamble is successful. Lines of unprepared French knights oh. and nobles push and shove amongst themselves, oh, wow. eager They're to shoving. engage their English counterparts. They do that. Henry's longbowmen will be the key to oh, defeating the, the French. Striking them down as they traverse Dude, the muddy they're field. Guys and to ladies, they have, cavalry, they have their quivers on their backs, not at their side. In front of their positions. I don't understand. To emerge victorious, Henry must survive the upcoming battle and destroy or rout the French army before him. Only okay. then can he make his way home. Alright, so here it is. I'm going to pause this for a sec. Okay? Because there's another army over there, as you can see on the mini map. And then there's an army right there. So, so here's what I'm going to do. This army, like these units, are going to engage. And then I'm going to keep some units, like two or three units. Let's see. Oh, the billman, though. The heavy billman. Looking cool. Especially that guy over there. Alright, but anyway. But as I was saying, I'm going to keep some units to protect King Henry from that cavalry charge. Maybe a unit of archers and some infantry. Or the... So what I'm going to keep is the, the heavy billman. There's... I have two units of them. And then King Richard. He is right here. Right, right, he's right there, if you can see it. King Henry, he has a cool uniform. Okay. Right, all we have to do is wait. Looks like there's some upgrades. Here they come! Okay. So they're firing their air, their bows. Fire. Fire. Oh, there they go. There they go. Make your volley. Oh. So they have charged on what? English knights? They took heavy casualties there. 
levels of that unit? Let's see, seven to like, what, nine? by the way. Right? Yeoman archers. Okay. So things going well here. Oh, what's this? Okay, well these are yeoman archers. They're pretty good in melee. Oh, and then, um, uh, Alright, so the cav is moving there, so here's what I'm going to do, King King Henry will move like, um, I tell you, my billmen, which are my reserve force, is going to protect King Henry, so they're going to go there and then the other unit is going to protect king henry the unit oh whoops wrong area there so let's continue the battle all right let's see 15 to 19 okay cut more percentage lot percentage wise Oh, so they're going to make their, they're going to, go into they're formation. They're sending another wave of hapless fools at us. Uh, Hold the line. So here it is. Fighting still goes on. Here are the arrows. Okay. All right, now, that, that cavalry force is right there. All right, now they're in formation. Yes. Oh, they're breaking. Oh no, the cab. The cab. I didn't know they were there. Okay, well, it broke that force right there. Yep, they're broken. So they survived the first wave. They survived. Now here comes the next wave. Here they come. George. So yes, cavalry is still in the move. All right, here they go. So yes. Oh wait, wait, wait. Pause a sec. Here is the army right there, folks. So good thing I planned my defense here. All right, so I need to call in my back force to. Attack. All right, and let's do it. Don't have much troops. Cowardly dogs are behind us. Yep, they're behind us. They're going to. So they're going to go to the general's bodyguard. Going to fire their arrows. They were prepared for that. Oh, see that? Let's see, they're down to like 38. Okay. Oh, back to here though. Oh, the defense has failed. We'll have to fight them head on. Oh, they're now attacking the general. Oh, they're attacking the bodyguard. So yes. Who will win? Yeah. King Henry must not die. Not today. There's some. Oh, what are they doing? Oh, they're still getting picked off by arrows. Wow. Oh, 
they're still they're still fighting the good fight there. Oh good lord! There's more of these French dogs on their way. Oh King Henry can King Henry looks safe. Not for long though. To make like a new defense. A lot of archers that are in melee. Let's check out. He might not win today, but we might at least make this. Oh, he just got stabbed by the back. Oh, he's getting he's getting some support, and he's dead. All right, we'll just have to make this draw. If we can't win, then it has to be a draw. Okay. So. So yes. Now historically, they. Uh, England did win this war. Are they still picking off? Quickly, guard the king. He must not fall. All right, where's the king? Where's King Henry? Where is he? Can't see him. Oh! Oh, the enemy general has fallen. Our men have slain one of their generals. Oh, here's King Henry. He's being guarded by some archers. Please don't die from air fire. All right, so he's safe. He is safe. Oh no, what are we going to do? Bodyguard. Oh, let's see him fight. And so, let's see. They're warmed up and they're like shaken. Oh, what? What's he? All right, so he's going to battle him. Oh, he's gonna get double teamed, he's gonna get double teamed. Oh no. Oh, King Henry is dead. It's over. King Henry is slain. All is lost. At least we've broken some troops. He broke some. May the Lord Almighty have mercy on us. Our okay. Victory could not well, be greater. well, there, there was some remaining. Anymore. Like what? Four units. Alright, so close the feet. So King Henry getting 1,063 kills and 22 prisoners. Jenaga Mangri getting 430 kills and 0 prisoners. And Charles de Abret getting 270 kills and 0 prisoners. Anyways, look at the aftermath. Yeah, so here are the battle statistics right here. So, this is it for today, folks. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to click that subscribe button on your left, and I'll see you next time. Bye.